<laughs> Surprise! It's like on Instagram. Raven Elise TV. Hey guys, what's up? It's Raven. Welcome back to another vlog. It is currently like 3.30 a.m. 3.30 in the morning and I am in the airport. And I am with Ashley. <laughs> I am with Zaya. at the airport. I'm going on an airplane. I am also with my mom and my grandma. It's been a journey. We're not even on the plane yet. We are taking a trip to Savannah, Georgia, which is where my little sister goes to college. We're gonna go see her. We're gonna just go hang out in Savannah. It's my grandma's birthday. This is her birthday trip. She wanted to go to Savannah. I know I'm looking crusty right now. It's 3.30 in the morning, like I said. Our, our flight is at like five or something and then we have a connected flight so it's gonna be an interesting travel day mm -hmm. are you stressed what was I thinking <laughs> this was your idea and this is Zaya's like first real real plane ride that she's gonna like remember because she only went ride. when she was like six months old oh she told me she told you that yeah she told me she went on a plane ride she remembers so it's been a bit of a struggle getting all of our bags checked. We got We have the stroller, we have the car seat. Gotta make sure we have the blankie. <laughs> all of Zaya's stuff. I got two bags of snacks and entertainment, iPads, markers and things. Are you excited? Do you know what's going on? She's sleepy, we just we pulled her up out of bed in the middle of the night. It's four in the morning. Maybe you'll get excited once we get on the plane. And then you'll probably go to sleep, hopefully. Seems like street lights glowing Happen to be just like moments passing In front of me So I hopped in the cab and I paid my fare We're on the airplane! <laughs> I'm just out there, all these street lights Sit down in your very own seat Because you're older than two now, so you get your own seat Here, can you sit down and then we'll buckle up Wow, such a big girl. Wait, it goes like, stick it in there. Good job. All right, we made it on the plane. Skittles wow, at four in the morning. Might as, might as well. Anyway, we are officially on the plane. At least my grandma, my mom, me, and Zaya are on the plane. Ashley. Apparently left her Apple Watch in the check check security thing, and they called it over the loudspeaker like, "If you left your Apple Watch, come get it." And I was thinking, "Ooh, who left the Apple Watch?" And it was Ashley. <laughs> so we got to board the plane early because my grandma was in a wheelchair and Zyla Zyla Zaya was in a stroller, so we get special uh, early first boarding or whatever. So we're all settled in already. We haven't taken off yet, but she's already getting bored. <laughs> so we're breaking out the coloring book thingy. I'm just not there in these streets. We're gonna go up in the sky. So we made it to Charlotte, North Carolina for our connecting flight to Savannah, Georgia. We've been sitting here for about like an hour and a half, I think. Zaya is starting to get antsy. We got her iPad. We got her coloring book. We have some snacks. Just trying to keep her occupied. But she's starting to get a little difficult. And you know Zaya has to have some Adidas for the airport too. Are you cozy? 
<laughs> We're gonna get on another airplane. We have another airplane ride and then we're gonna go see Maya. You hungry? You already ate everything we have. I think you're just bored, not hungry. Go to the hotel. Maya, did you have a good flight? Is that fun being on two airplanes? You know, I'm just over it now. It's, she needs a nap. Sure am hungry. Are you hungry? We're gonna go to Miss Wilkes. Apparently it's real good. Bacon and eggs? <laughs> That's random. I hope she got some bacon and eggs for you. We'll see. Grammy is over there getting the rental car. Do you know where we are, Zaya? You don't know? We're in Savannah, Georgia, and this is where Maya lives and goes to school. From Beaumont to Boston. Huh? She's not here in the airport. We gotta go to her school. So, but first, we're gonna go get something to eat. Then we're gonna go to the hotel, and then later we're gonna go to Maya's school. Are you excited to see Maya? Yes. Grammy got the rental car. Time to go. Everybody ready? Girls trip. We are officially in the city. And we were going to go to that famous Mrs. Wilkes place, but we didn't realize how famous it was. And there was a super long line waiting to just even get in there. And they're closing soon. So that was a no. So we pulled up to a different restaurant called The Distillery, I think. Zaya is, of course, knocked. Poor baby, she's been up since 2 a.m. I knew she was sleepy. Now we gotta wake her up and bring her in this restaurant. The struggle. Ooh, that looks so good. Shrimp po' boys, yes. What did you get, Grammy? Green tomato BLT. We got BLT so Zaya can have some. Bacon. We are at the Alida, I think it's called, hotel. They got some cute little gift shop stuff out here. It smells like essential oils. Nice little hipster vibe. I like the furniture. We made it to our room. I like their um, aesthetic in this hotel. It's kind of like a industrial mid-century, I don't know. We all gonna be sharing these beds. A nice little, um, what is this called? Bay window, is that a bay window? Bay window. A little extra lounge seating and the closets are hidden, hidden behind the curtains. But we do not have a view, we have a construction view because the room with the view was going to take an hour longer to be ready, and with Zaya acting how she acting, we did not have an hour to wait around. What are you doing up there? Breaking stuff. Oh, Lord. Literally breaking stuff over here. Anyway. Okay, don't open that. Oh. Ooh, breaking more stuff over there. Good God. Behind the curtain, we have fancy snacks, they say. Oh, wow. Really fancy Skittles and gummy bears. And then this, underneath the seat, is actually the mini fridge. I've been wearing these clothes since five o'clock yesterday. <laughs> uh, literally, my hair is just like a rat's nest. Okay, so it's a little bit later in the day now. We had some resting time in the hotel room. It's about 6 p.m. and we are now headed to go surprise Maya. Well. She's gonna be surprised about the fact that me and Zaya came along. She didn't know we were coming. So we're gonna surprise her. We're gonna go check out where she lives while she's attending college here in Savannah, Georgia. Just come check on her, you know, a little bit. And then after that, we are gonna go hit the town. Surprise! 
Busted. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You follow, you actually look at my Instagram. Yeah, you hi, Say hi, Diane. you. I said, maybe it's like a little white girl coming down there. I thought that's my hair. <laughs> There's Maya. You've been asking this whole time. When are we going to see Maya? And now you don't say anything? Of course. My grandma is trying out one of these electric scooters for the first time. We're about to go walking down by the river and go down there where the restaurants and the shops are and go get something to eat. Maya is with us now for the shenanigans. Comment down below if you think she looks like an art teacher. <laughs> Zaya, of course, got the iPad. It's been a long day. So I'm just letting her do whatever keeps her happy. Here we go. Grandmother. We put her on the, the slow speed, but I think it's a little too slow. <laughs> Buildings and bars. I would rather the cottage change. <laughs> Maya is embarrassed because we're acting like tourists in her in her town. <laughs> Everybody, everybody's recording each other. Vlogception. And Zaya just doesn't care. All right, let's go find our restaurant because it's about to be dark. The lights of paradise I feel invincible. The sun, the moon, they share the skies, but us invisible. And when the wind blows, everything moves together. I really see something I want to try. So we found this little boutique down here, and they have these cute little zodiac constellation necklaces. So this is a gold plated Virgo constellation. I think I'm going to get this to add to my Virgo necklace that I always wear. Put the glasses on. Tell me something like an art teacher right now. <laughs> Zaya is absolutely worn out. We're at the restaurant now. We're at the Cotton Exchange Shifu Grill and Tavern. Maya is showing some pictures of some of her projects she's been doing in school. This is called the Exchange Sweet Tea. It's with sweet tea flavored vodka and lemonade. So it's basically like alcoholic Arnold Palmer. Look what happened to uh, Zaya's hair. Her rubber band popped out, so she's been walking around with one ponytail. Oh well. We went into that world famous River Street Sweets. Let's see what we got. Although you do not need any more sweets, but I guess we're kind of on vacation, so. Sprinkle covered, chocolate covered pretzel. Isn't it? Isn't it? Here, let me break it piece off for you. Here you go. Does that look yummy? Is it good? Mmm. The dark chocolate. I think it has my name all over it. Is this it? Yeah. A graham cracker? Yeah. You wanna get me eating stuff. This time where the festivity is going to start tomorrow. Day two in Savannah, Georgia. It's Saturday. Here's my casual OOTD. A striped shirt from Target. A sweater from probably Forever 21 a while back. My Jamie jeans from Topshop. And some white Air Maxes. And I am wearing Ross. <laughs> Top to bottom, except for my Oh, you have a nice designer jacket. jacket. Yes, that my sister bought me. Courtesy of Raven Elise. And of course, because I'm annoying like that, Zaya is wearing a matching outfit to me. She's over here in her own world with the black blankie and the iPad, her two obsessions. She has white sneakers on, she has her little white Converse, light wash jeans. We both have the cuffs on the jeans. And she has a, let me see her shirt. What kind of shirt do you have on? She has a striped shirt too. And she's wearing her hair down like mommy too. Ooh, we need to wipe your nose. 
So we came out here to the, are we on the square or what is it called? Uh, this Downtown. is still on River Street. On River Street. Uh, we're just looking at all the different shops and boutiques. We're in this really cute little sustainable shop. Just want to find some unique items, maybe. Oh. It's not cold, it's warm, Zaya. You're trying to trick me. You're trying to trick me and I'm not falling for it because you just want your security blanket and we don't need to carry that around. It's very warm. It is. Not warm. It is. No. You'll be okay. Look at these elephants, Zaya. No. That's cute. Oh, that's cute. It looks like the thingy on the top of a champagne. Like champagne cork thingy. What do you think of that? Look at them. You don't like them? You like birds. She said, I don't like the horses, I like birds. Okay. Is the um, statue that's dedicated to the African soldiers who fought in the American Revolution. Did you find some sunglasses? Wow! Okay. Do you have some money to buy them? I don't have money. What about a hat? Ooh, that would be cute. Do you like those sunglasses? I can't hear you. Okay. Can you buy them? What do you say? Huh? Okay. Ashley and Grandma, they're doing a photo shoot. We're at City Market, where all the little shops and boutiques are. Grandmother is going wild on her motor scooter. <laughs> Grandma gone wild. <laughs> You didn't want it at first, now you like it. I just got a berry and peach swirl moonshine smoothie. I don't even know what alcohol is in here. I think that the moonshine has moonshine, whatever. You can't put real moonshine in it. Anyway, there's some kind of liquor in here. It's called moonshine something. It's berry peach swirl. We got it from the Georgia Tasting Room. They also had like wine smoothies with like flavors and wine mixed in. So now we're going to go back through City Market and head towards Broughton Street, which is basically downtown Savannah. Walking around downtown Savannah, Georgia. Paula Deen's store. Where? Ashley said we're boycotting Paula Deen because she's racist. She's racist. Okay. <laughs> this one, Lady and Sons. Hey y'all, must be. If it says hey y'all. <laughs> we are doing my biggest pet peeve right now. People just walking crazy, blocking the sidewalk. We're struggling a little bit because mommy is our tour guide. I got the stroller, grandmother's on the scooter. I'm trying to make sure we keep up with everybody. Everybody crossing the street. These little streets are small. The sidewalks are narrow. We're having deja vu. Hi! If you guys remember my first Savannah vlog, I'm here with Corey. She's the one, the oh. crochet queen. She's yes. wearing one of her creations. I have that one in pink. Yes. That's the same one, right? Yeah, the mesh sweater. And a couple of other things that she made for me that you guys will be seeing. I have some wow. styling plans. Oh my stuff gosh. Stuff with too that she made. She makes such cool stuff. Thank you. But yeah, I met her last time I was here in Savannah, the first time I came. And I'm so happy that she's back. <laughs> So yeah, it was it was like a coincidence. We were I know every time I see you street, it's just now a random situation. I'm always in the right place at the right time. <laughs> That's what happens. <laughs> okay, so we just finished having a little light lunch at this Goose Feather restaurant cafe place. Right now we are getting ready to head back over towards the river because we have a river boat tour that we're gonna do. I said that we should do something, you know, a, a little activity, like a little special Savannah activity. So we're gonna go on the river boat. I really don't know what it's all about, but we're gonna find out. Savannah, Georgia river boat cruise. You ready to go on the boat? You're just not having it, this whole trip. Grumpy. We 
We got a little dining hall in here on the boat, the dance floors, a stage, <laughs> a buffet, a bar. If you want to be closer to the water, we're going to see the sights on Savannah, Georgia River boat cruise. <laughs> Don't know if y'all can tell, but we're moving. We're cruising. And he's giving a, a tour and information over the loudspeaker in here. You hungry. What do you want to eat? Of course. Holy, holy, that's dropping onto this on a okay. semi for a train car. <laughs> Don't sound smart to me. Let's go out on the dock and see what to see out here on the Savannah Georgia. <laughs> I keep saying that. I'm gonna walk up here so I can get a better view. Really big. You and Grammy are matching right now. We're matching hair, matching shirt colors. Wow, Zaya, this is a big boat. Look, they're about to shoot the cannon, Zaya. Look, can you see? Woo, there it goes. We've been drinking lots of little frozen drinks. I got a little strawberry margarita. It was so much that they had to put it in two cups. This is one drink that got split into two cups. Huh? You can't have this because it has alcohol in it. you guys so we are back in the hotel now we came back after eating dinner to just rest a little bit my mom is actually gone she went to meet up with one of her friends who lives here for drinks so it's just me Zaya my grandma and Ashley chilling in the hotel room uh, me and Ashley are going on a ghost haunted tour thing later at like 10 p.m. So we were just about to get ready for that. Ashley went to go take a shower, and the shower apparently was like not draining at all. So all the water was just like going out of the shower and flooding the bathroom instead of going down the drain. So our bathroom is now flooded. It's not enough water yet to like start pouring out of the bathroom, but if she would have let the water run for like an additional two more minutes, it would have been much worse. <laughs> She's in there mad because she really wanted to take a she, she just went to the gym while we were waiting. So she's fresh from the gym, trying to take a shower to get ready for this thing we're going to. So she's mad, but we gotta call someone and tell them that we flooded the bathroom somehow. I'm worried that they're going to basically tell us that we need to pack up all our stuff and switch rooms. I'm also worried that they might not have another room ready for us. So, stay tuned. All right, so Ashley and I are heading to this ghost tour. We stopped in the hotel bar before we left to have a drink. I had a nice little strawberry, it was called a strawberry phosphate, little spritzer drink. Ashley took a tequila shot <laughs> and had a gin and tonic or something like that. Some kind of something. And we just took an Uber over here to the, I guess this is the meetup spot because we got the cemetery. We got the cemetery. I haven't seen the guide yet. We're moving, our guide is here. Huh? And I'm glad to have you here with me tonight. <laughs> Welcome to America's most haunted city, Savannah, Georgia. So we just finished the ghost tour. We're still sitting in the last haunted area. That's a place where one of the 
hauntings or the whatever Mercer house. the Mercer house yeah. happened so we're still sitting here the group is gone the tour guide is gone but it was a, a cute little educational it wasn't scary were you scared or disturbed at any point I'm disturbed that we're walking on dead bodies all the time <laughs> yeah we learned some fun <laughs> facts that basically Savannah is all like constructed on top of dead bodies there's a lot of dead bodies underneath all the sidewalks and stuff that's death. and that's part of the reason why the sidewalks are so bumpy is because it's just a bunch of dead bodies and caskets and things so that's disturbing it was mostly just like an educational tour and then he was like cracking some jokes throughout so it's mostly just like funny and not scary not really funny but just i don't know it was cute i learned some things i felt like i learned some history but yeah, it wasn't scary, so whatever. It definitely looks kind of haunted and creepy throughout this town, but Gordon. I didn't see any ghosts. Good morning, it's day three, Sunday in Savannah, Georgia. We're on the Riverwalk area thing again. We're going to have breakfast at Huey's. We wanted to go to Huey's last night for dinner because we heard it was pretty good, but the wait was really long. So we ended up going somewhere else. Anyway, we're going to this restaurant we wanted to go to yesterday, but we're going for breakfast instead. So let's go. Slow pokes. Yeah. Breakfast, what you got, Raven? French toast and potatoes. I guess. <laughs> I got the chicken bamboo. Pain. Pain. What about you? What you got, Zaya? Bacon. The eggs and toast. <laughs> Grandmother. Grits. Wow. Garlic grits. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so it's our last day here in Savannah, Georgia. We're getting ready to leave. We're packing up all our stuff. I'm already packed up. We mostly packed up. It's about 10.30 in the morning right now. Checkout time is 11. Yesterday, I feel like I didn't talk too much to the camera, but yesterday, we went to a restaurant called Huey's, which was decent. It was too much food. I didn't get to fully enjoy it because I wasn't hungry enough, but it was, it was good food, so I would recommend Huey's on the river walk that's probably the only place that i would recommend on the river walk to eat and then we went driving around savannah looking at some of the historical sites looking at some of the uh, scad buildings and just kind of taking a little driving tour around then we went to the wormslow Obs why do i keep wanting to say observatory <laughs> then we went to the wormslow historical site and it was cool because we got special treatment because grandmother's with us. <laughs> so since uh, she couldn't drive her motor scooter through there, one of the park rangers gave us a special tour on a golf cart. We learned about some colonial stuff, some slavery stuff. We learned that Spanish moss is not from Spain. It was just called that because it, people were being racist and making fun of <laughs> Spanish people's beards. So we learned some fun facts, some historical facts. We did a lot of like just sightseeing and driving around yesterday. And then we ate lunch at the best restaurant we went to this whole time. It was just over in a shopping center next to a Target. So it wasn't anything historical. It wasn't anything on the Riverwalk, but it was a chicken place called Gr Grenadines. <laughs> Geneva's. No. <laughs> Geneva's. Something with a G. Geneva's. I got footage of it, which you Geneva's guys are seeing chicken. right now on the screen. Geneva's chicken and cornbread. Geneva's chicken and cornbread. That was the best place we ate at, like I said, in a shopping center, whatever. But it was really good. I believe, just by looking at it, it was like family owned and operated. It was really good. Fried chicken, cornbread, different flavors of cornbread. So if you take anything from this vlog, don't even think that you're gonna get anything special with like the well-known restaurants down on the Riverwalk, definitely go check out this chicken place because that was the best food we pretty much ate. This trip has been a little stressful with Zaya. My mom is really sick. She's been sick during the whole trip. You know, trying to figure out with my grandma with her scooter and stuff. So we just came back and took a nap <laughs> yesterday. Are you sick too? You're crusty, you need to wipe your face. And then we went to dinner at another seafood place. By then, I think we were all tired of eating, <laughs> period. <laughs> it's our last night in Savannah. It was Pearl's Saltwater My, Grill. My place is not crusty. Yes, it is, <laughs> so you need to wipe it. The food was decent, um, but 
we're just we've been eating breakfast lunch and dinner like a lot of like seafood fried food stuff so i ordered calamari but i didn't really like eat most of it but i mean it was good yeah last night i went on the rooftop bar of this hotel with ashley which was nice we had some tasty cocktails went to bed and now we're here getting ready to leave so hopefully we can stop by starbucks and then we will be back at the airport going back to austin going home are you ready to go home you not you want to stay here well, where do you want to go? Um, Austin. Austin, okay, so you are ready to go home. 